Hey everybody, welcome to the Witcher Math Channel. Today it's the craft stick, kinetic energy, potential energy, cobra weave, exploding stick challenge, whatever you want to call it. It's called a lot of different things online if you search it up. But it all comes down to using some craft sticks. Regular popsicle sticks are just, they're so hard to work, to work with because they're not very flexible and uh, just makes stuff like this harder. The craft sticks are kind of flexible. They bend a little better, easier to work with. Okay, so I'm starting with this kind of cross, sort of a cross shape, kind of like, it looks like the beginning of the letter K maybe. And so I've got a yellow going under a green. Now I've got a yellow going on top of a green Got kind of an equal sign there. Going to continue. I'm going to turn it sideways this way because I want to mani manipulate this green one so it kind of makes a letter A here or a greater than sign or a less than sign. So where this one is going under, I want this to go over. And so I need to pry it under there. There we go. The hand is quicker than the eye. Okay, so I'm holding tension with one finger. I'm going to bring this, uh, these two green sticks a little closer together. You'll see why in a moment. Okay, so that's looking pretty good right now. I've got my kind of less than sign pointing that way and my equal sign pointing that way. Now, I need another green stick in here. So I'm going to use the edge of the table. It's my top secret technique. Don't tell anybody. Under, over. And you start to see the beginning of this weaving pattern going. Two going that way, two going that way. Now since so I did green, I need to do yellow. We're just going to take turns. Colors also make it easier for you to take turns. Some people like to number the sticks. But once you see the pattern start going, then it gets easier. So I'm going to go back to my edge of the table technique. And I'm just kind of prying it under, under this green stick over here. Back on camera. Okay. What's going next? I just did yellow. What's next? Right! Green. But it looks like I don't have quite enough room to get a green one in there, so I'm going to kind of adjust my shape a little bit to create some space. Later on, as you continue this pattern, you won't have to manipulate the sticks quite so much. The more sticks you have, the less tension there is on each stick, and then the easier it is to get your shape. Sometimes that happens, it's all right. Keep it where it was, keep tension on it, under, over. Don't give up. Don't give up! There we go, looking good. Two yellow, two green, two yellow, two green. So I need another yellow. Under and over. There we go. At any point, you should be able to keep tension on this with one finger. Since I just did yellow, I need green. Back to the edge of the table. You don't have to use the edge of the table, but for me, it sure makes it a lot easier. Under and over. Good, good. Even these out a little bit. Tension right there. I just did green, so I need yellow. See the technique? Ooh, nice. OK, 
Okay. And I ran out of green, so I had to go to the bucket and get another one. Keep intention on there, but also hopefully allowing you to see this one's over. So this one in my hand needs to go under before it goes over the next one. See how my spacing, as I go along, my spacing is becoming, it went from being really tight and very tense. Now it's kind of loosening up a little bit and you'll see that happens as you continue on down the line. There's that. I was gonna stop at 11, which I have now, but I'm gonna keep going just a little bit so you can see how once you get going, it's easier and easier. What color do I need now? I just did green. Right, I need yellow. There's that. I'm just gonna keep going for a while. This is so easy, it's so fun. I mean, you can shut the video off at any point now because at this point, you get it, right? You see what's happening here? I'm gonna do like two more and then I'm gonna stop. I just did green, do a yellow, do another green. Another yellow. Man, it's addictive, I can't stop. I should have stopped the video like two minutes ago, but it's bonus footage. Okay, there we go. Now, if you want, if you get tired, you need a break, you need a snack, go to the bathroom, I don't know. We need a way to cap this off without letting it go so you can come back to it. So we need a stick that's gonna go this way and hold tension on the whole thing. So where normally I would be sliding this yellow, let's make it a yellow. <clears throat> I would be sliding this yellow under here. All I need to do is with brute force and a little bit of love and care, Manipulate this. So it's over, under, over. Now with any luck at all, I should be able to hold tension here. There, we let it go. I should be able to let that go. And there we go. Get it back to the beginning. There we are. Got our original sign there, our two yellows, two greens, two yellows, two greens, and so on. <clears throat> and I think I did about 20 sticks here. I'm not going to count them. Good enough, right? All right, thanks for watching. Woo! Now let's watch it explode. All I do is take this one off. I got my tension and boom, done for now. Goodbye.